Hedgehogs. Chapter 1. Meet the Hedgehog. If you're looking for a pet that is friendly, quiet, and cute, a hedgehog might be for you. Although they are shy animals, hedgehogs bond with their owners. They're also, they are also easy to care for and do not need a lot of space. What's another reason hedgehogs are so popular? They do not have bad odors like some pets. Hedgehogs can also be curious and playful. Many hedgehogs cuddle with their caretakers. Even though hedgehogs are not always social, they can be fun and engaging pets. What's a hedgehog? Hedgehogs are mammals. They get their name from their behavior in the wild. They hunt and sniff for food underneath hedges and brush. While they are hunting, they make snorting sounds like a pig. Hedgehogs in the wild. Hedgehogs are not native to North America. In the wild, hedgehogs live in Europe, Asia, and Africa. Hedgehogs are nocturnal. They sleep during the day and look for food at night. Some species of hedgehogs hibernate in the winter. Hedgehogs are omnivores. They eat bugs, plants, worms, rodents, lizards, and even snakes. Their eyesight is very poor, but they have a strong sense of smell. Their snouts can sniff out bugs two inches below ground. There are 17 hedgehog species. They come in different sizes and colors, and they all behave in different ways. Pet hedgehogs are African pygmies. They are a mix of a white-bellied and Algerian hedgehog species. Spines, snouts, and squeals. What do you notice first about a hedgehog? It's probably the sharp spines that cover its back and sides. These stiff, non-venomous spines keep animals safe, keep the animal safe from predators. When frightened, the hedgehog curls into a tight ball its spines pr point outward, protecting it from danger. The hedgehog's underbelly is covered in white or tan fur. Most hedgehogs have white or cream colored spines with bands of brown or black. Some hedgehogs have raccoon-like markings on their faces with, large, with dark fur around their nose and eyes. Hedgehogs have five toes on their front feet and four toes on their back feet. Their long pointed noses twitch when they sniff around and explore. African pygmies are six to eight inches long. They weigh 18 to 25 ounces. That is about the same weight as two cans of soup. Other species of hedgehogs are larger. They can grow to 10.5 inches long and weigh up to 2.25 pounds. In the wild, hedgehogs live for two to three years. Hedgehogs make lots of different noises. They communicate with their sn with snorts, squeals, and puffs and hisses. Hedgehogs make a clicking sound when they are angry. Hedgehogs and humans. People have a long history with hedgehogs. Hedgehogs first appeared in artwork thousands of years ago. Ancient Egyptians showed hedgehogs on ceramic bowls, jewelry, and ships. In the 1500s, Shakespeare wrote about hedgehogs. In a few of his plays, he called them hedge pigs. Despite the hedgehog's long place in history, they are somewhat new as pets. People first brought hedgehogs to the United States from Africa in the 1970s. Today, hedgehogs are popular pets around the world, especially in the United States and the United Kingdom. Clubs, shows, and websites are dedicated to hedgehogs. A convention called Hedgy Con is held every year in the United States. Social media has helped the hedgehog gain fame and popularity. Facebook and Instagram pages feature life with pet hedgehogs. A hedgehog named Mr. Pokey has 435,000 followers on Instagram and nearly 40,000 followers on Facebook. Chapter 2 Hedgehogs as pets. Caring for a pet is a big responsibility. Although hedgehogs are easier to take care of than many other pets, they still need daily attention. Talk to your parents about owning a hedgehog. Ask yourself these questions before you decide if a hedgehog is right for you. Do you have the time to care for a hedgehog? Will you have time to feed it, clean its cage, and play with it? How, many, how much does a hedgehog cost to buy? 
How much does its food and other supplies cost? Who will pay for the animal and everything it needs, you or your parents? Who will take care of the hedgehog, you or your parents or siblings, or will you all share in the responsibility? Is there a vet in your area who takes care of hedgehogs? Do you have space in your home for the hedgehog's cage? More to know. Do you think you are ready for a pet hedgehog? You'll need to consider a few other things before you get one. Do you have other pets in your home? Cats will usually leave a hedgehog alone when, they're, when they see its sharp spines. However, use caution if introducing dogs to a new hedgehog. Dogs may be aggressive. They could easily harm the hedgehog. Never leave your hedgehog unsupervised in the same room with your cat or dog. If you have other pets such as rats, lizards, or rabbits, ask a parent to help you research how they get along with the hedgehog. Before you adopt a hedgehog, make sure the pet is allowed where you live. California, Georgia, Hawaii, Pennsylvania, and New York City have laws against owning hedgehogs. The laws are in place to prevent owners from releasing unwanted hedgehogs into the wild. Freed hedgehogs compete with native animals for food and living space. Also, pet hedgehogs do not have the skills to survive in the wild. If you get a pet hedgehog and then decide that it's not the right pet for you, do not let it go free outside. Find a home for the hedgehog, such as with a breeder or with someone who wants to adopt it. Choosing your hedgehog. You've decided that a hedgehog is the right pet for you. Now where do you get one? How do you decide which one to get? The best way is from a breeder. He or she will help you choose a hedgehog and show you how to take care of it. There are dozens of breeders across the United States, Canada, and Europe. Another option is to find a rescue agency in your area that has hedgehogs to adopt. Choose a hedgehog that is healthy and has a good temperament. It should have clear and bright eyes, a moist and clean nose, and fur on its underbelly that is not matted. The best time to bring a hedgehog home is when it's six to 11 weeks old. At this age, the hedgehog can easily adapt to its new home and surroundings. Visiting the vet. Soon after you get your hedgehog, make an appointment with a vet who knows how to take care of the animal. The vet will make sure your pet is healthy. The vet can also give you advice on caring for your new hedgehog. Visit the vet once a year to check your hedgehog's weight and overall health. If your hedgehog ever gets sick, you will have a vet who already knows you and your pet. Chapter three, caring for your hedgehog. What kind of cage should you get for your hedgehog? What should you feed it? Can you play with it? You may have a lot of questions about how to take care of your hedgehog. Make sure to learn everything you can before you bring your hedgehog home. Home sweet hedgehog home. Hedgehogs need the right cage in order to stay safe and comfortable. They do best in a large cage with a flat bottom, similar to a guinea pig or rabbit cage. These cages are usually two feet by four feet. Cover the bottom with soft bedding. Most pet stores sell bedding made from recycled paper or fluffy pulp. Make sure your hedgehog has plenty of water. Put the water in a bowl or a water bottle attached to the cage. Hedgehogs like to burrow and be covered, especially when they sleep. A miniature sleeping bag is a cozy spot for your hedgehog. Hedgehogs can be trained to use a litter box. Put a small box in their cage and fill it with litter pellets. Empty the litter box and clean the animal's food bowls every day. The bedding should be changed and the cage thoroughly cleaned once a week. It's important to keep your hedgehog warm. Its environment should be 72 to 80 degrees Fahrenheit. Some breeders suggest using a heating pad under part of the cage or a heat lamp. If African pygmies get too cold, they could go into hibernation. This can be life-threatening to them. Meals and food. Pet hedgehogs do well with a diet of dried or canned cat food, along with mealworms, crickets, and chopped vegetables. Dry cat food also works well because it is high in protein. Feed your hedgehog a variety of foods. This helps it get all the nutrients it needs. 
It also allows the animal to experience different textures. You can feed your hedgehog fruit, but only small amounts. Too much fruit can lead to health problems such as obesity, diabetes, and dental disease. Bathing and grooming. Hedgehogs mostly groom themselves. You will only need to bathe your hedgehog about once a month. A bath will loosen bedding and dirt from their spines. Bathing your hedgehog more often can cause dry skin. Hedgehogs have toenails that need to be trimmed regularly. Clip the nails with small nail clippers. Be careful not to cut too deeply. It's easy to clip down into the soft part of the nail and cause bleeding. Hedgehog connection. Interacting daily with your hedgehog is a great way to create a strong connection. Start by taking your hedgehog out of its cage each day until it gets used to you. You do not need to wear gloves when you pick up a hedgehog. Its spines look dangerous, but they only give a slight prick. Picking your pet up by its sides, at first it will probably be nervous and stay balled up. Gently rock it from side to side and rub its neck to get it to unroll. Once you and your family are comfortable handling the hedgehog, take it out regularly. Play with it, give it treats, or just hold it. Another way to connect with your hedgehog is to talk to it so it learns to recognize your voice. Your hedgehog will also get to know your smell, especially if you hold it often. Make sure your family members also hold your hedgehog frequently. Chapter 4 Fun and Games In many ways, hedgehogs are just like you. They like to play, explore, and enjoy a treat now and then. Experiment with different ways to keep your hedgehog active, healthy, and stimulated. A healthy, happy hedgehog. Have you and your new hedgehog adjusted to one another? That's great. Now be sure to keep your pet happy and healthy. One way is to make sure your hedgehog's cage stays safe and fun. A large exercise wheel is key to making sure your hedgehog gets enough exercise. Hedgehogs often climb and explore. Set up a few levels of ramps and tunnels to keep your pet active. Try putting toilet paper tubes, PVC pipe, and small pieces of soft fabric in the cage. Your hedgehog can use it, its foraging and rooting skills if you scatter treats around for them to find. Hedgehog routine. Although hedgehogs sleep during the day, your pet can adjust somewhat to your schedule. Late afternoons and evenings are good times to interact with your hedgehog. It'll be more alert and active during these time, this time. Sometimes hedgehogs are grouchy when they first wake up. They might also be grumpy when they are losing their baby spines during the quilling process. You will know when your pet is angry. It'll make a clicking sound. The best thing to do when your pet is unhappy is to leave it alone. Try interacting with it again when it has calmed down. As you get to know and bond with your pet, you will learn its likes and dislikes. Toys and treats. Giving your hedgehog toys to play with will help keep it healthy and active. You can make or buy all kinds of fun toys for your pet. Toys for cats and birds work well for hedgehogs. Hedgehogs will explore inside paper bags, oatmeal containers, and shoe boxes. Balls, bells, and chew toys also keep the hedgehog engaged. Another fun way to interact with your pet is to give it treats. Insects or worms for, from a pet store make great treats. Some hedgehogs even eat scrambled eggs. Just don't give your pet too many treats. You do not want it to spoil its appetite. Stay away from foods that are sugary, sticky, or salty. Room to run. Consider getting a pet playpen for your hedgehog. Your pet can run in its large area instead of just in its cage. Be careful if you bring your hedgehog outside. You do not want it to run away or be harmed by another animal. Keep it in an enclosed area where it is protected from harm and where you can keep an eye on it. If you let your hedgehog roam around in the grass, be sure the grass is free from harmful chemicals. A member of the family. Each hedgehog has its own special personality. Some are very active, others are quiet. Some like to be held while others like to be left alone. No matter the personality of your hedgehog, it can form a, bond, a strong bond with you and become a beloved member of your family. Take the time to learn all about hedgehogs, not only before you adopt one, but after it has joined your home. 
read books, and have a parent help you research online, consider joining a hedgehog club as well. Here, you can get to know other hedgehog owners and share tips and stories. Look for a hedgehog show in your area. The more you know about the cute animals, the better you can care for one. Pet hedgehogs typically live for 8 to 10 years. By taking good care of your hedgehog, you can enjoy many years together. Hedgehogs.